In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use your Android phone and mirror your screen to your Chromecast device. Let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome to Tech with Brett, where I help tech work for you. And today I'm going to show you how to mirror your Android phone to your Chromecast device. I use this all the time, so I wanted to show you how to do it. The first thing that you need to do is make sure that your phone has Android 4.4.2 or above. In today's video, I have a phone that is using Android 8.0. Now, most of the phones do have that today. Um, so if yours is too old, you may need to upgrade. Before we begin, I do wanna mention that this will only work on Android devices. iPhones or iOS devices, as well as Windows phones are not supported. So first I'm going to make sure that my power saving mode is off. So right here, because that is gray, that means it is off. Second, I'm going to go into the settings of my phone and I'm going to go into the apps and then I'm gonna go down to Google Play Services. Now under here, under the permissions, I'm going to make sure that my microphone is enabled. So if that is gray, make sure you turn that on. Then you need to make sure that your Chromecast and your phone are on the same Wi-Fi network. Now we are ready to go into the Google Home application. And once we are in here, we just need to select the menu in the top left and then here we need to select cast screen and audio. So you will get this notification that says this device is not optimized for casting, so your experience may vary. Now, back in the day, they used to optimize many of the high-end phones, but today they're not doing that as much, so you don't need to worry about this notification. Just select OK, and now it is asking what device you want to cast to. So in today's video, I will be using the Chromecast Ultra, but this will also work with the regular Chromecast device. So here I'm going to select Chromecast Ultra. And now my screen is being mirrored onto the Chromecast device. And there you can see that whatever I'm doing on my phone, it is showing up over on the TV. So if I rotate my phone or go into a certain application, it will show up on there as well. Now just about everything that I do on my phone will show up on here. There are a few applications that for copyright issues, it will not mirror on the screen, but I could go to different videos, I can go to different apps, I can browse the web, and everything will show up on my TV. Now, if you do want to play games, it will work on the TV, but there may be a little bit of lag, so just be wary of that. It's because it is using your Wi-Fi to be able to cast this over, so it's not a dedicated connection. That's why there might be a little bit lag. But the screen quality looks really good. Every application pops right up, just like on my phone, and you can see that you have the full video experience right here on the device. So here I can even use Google Maps and whatever application I want. If I select menu, I have the recent applications and I can even do the two applications at once if I would like to. That's how much shows up on your screen. Now, when you are finished mirroring your Android phone to your Chromecast, there are two ways which you can stop casting. One is to go into the Google Home application and you will need to go back to the same menu and go into the cast screen and audio portion. And then here you would want to select disconnect. Now the other option is to just pull down the notification tray and then here you can see casting screen. Now if you do pull that down again, you do have the disconnect option right here. Once you select that, it will then stop casting to your Chromecast. And when you are done casting, you'll see that the Chromecast turns back to its ambient mode. To adjust these settings, you can also go into the devices tab, go to the Chromecast that you are casting to and here I could change the volume as well. And then here I have a stop mirroring option. Now it will only continue casting while you are on the same Wi-Fi network. If you were to leave, it will no longer cast. When you are casting and watching a video, you can use the volume buttons on your Android phone to change the volume. So here I can change it up as well as I can change it down. Now I have used this feature in many different ways, sharing videos and pictures right to the TV without having to do some complicated setup or plug in my computer. It's great to, that it can be done all with on the Android device. And I have Chromecast on pretty much all my TVs. I hope this video is helpful for you in using your Android device to cast it to your Chromecast. If you guys have any further questions about how this works, let me know in the comments below. And if you would like to see how to cast the audio from your Android phone to a Google Home device, make sure you select the video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.